a previous lesson, we reviewed inequalities. Now, in this lesson, we're going to apply those skills that we used, and we're going to work on graphing inequalities, solving inequalities, and solving word problems with inequalities. So first, let's just real quick go over what inequalities are. Now, you know if you see this symbol, that means greater than. All right. Now, this symbol, that means less than. All right. Now, this symbol means greater than or equal to. And this symbol means less than or equal to. Okay, so if we have the greater than symbol, so we could say a is greater than 2, all right? Now, the less than symbol, we could say 2 is less than 8. The greater than or equal symbol, equal to symbol. Well, when you have that, it could be basically just what it says. It could be greater than or it could be equal to. So let's come up with a couple examples. We could say 8 is greater than or equal to 2 because 8 is greater than 2. So that works. But we could also say 2 is greater than or equal to 2. 